Hey there, everyone. This is Al Cal playing Hero Core. And last time we beat the game. All right. I said we would change the text to retro for uh, somewhat English. Translate by Daniel Ramar. Yeah, like I said, I would do that in retro, so we can have at least slightly. Oh, it has uh, lines now. All right, hero level X. Okay, I don't think I ever really paid attention to the information there. All right, so we got hard. We unlocked annihilation. That's not what we're doing today. We are starting hard. Choose this to want a more challenge. Hard enemy pattern and another world. On a far asteroid, I had battled a great gentleman of mechanical war, the Tetron Cruiser, who dangered the Earth with his employees. This is fun. <laughs> Left behind the powder of the metal. Like, it's hard to do believable uh, Engrish. I feel like this is going a bit far, but it's still funny. Now we need a new base and a new master somehow, much like every time that had time before. Time that time! This uh, one cruiser can be impossible. Well, can I defeat him now again? Uh, oh, well, yeah, all you need to do is find 10 computers. So there we go, new start. The map shape is generally the same, it looks like. Except we are in a completely different starting area, which is exciting. Yeah, it also looks like to be the same level shape. Uh, but uh, we are in a brand new world. Whoa, keep it up! <laughs> I love that. All right, let's see how this goes. Uh, has a slightly map of the, oh, 10 zone asteroid. Uh, uh-huh. All right, so starting off in some fun time. I don't have the blade. Uh, it's kind of oddly, uh, just empty for now. Yeah, yeah, what does the database look like? Keep it up. Uh, no, everything seems to be kind of the same functionally. All right, so we gotta destroy this. This is boiling metal flow. Uh, yeah, so I can get heated and then I'm flashing a little bit while it's cooling off. All right, little robot. Everyone disciplined. <laughs> That's pretty good. All right, starting right next to new buddies. Uh, so, I don't know why. I was expecting things to start, like, super nutso, completely, like, unbelievable, super kill, death zone, laser place. Uh, but turns out it's still starting with, uh, you know, some level of niceness. Like, this really isn't all that bad. Like, it, it feels... Uh, oh, we're on the natural cave. Danger alert. I like danger alert as a team third term. Okay, worm spit stuff now. That's fun. Look at that guy, you know? Oh, uh, he's in... Oh, I... I forgot how much I take damage in, uh... Level zero. So I guess I can... Okay, there you go. I didn't have to kill it, but I chose to. Uh... Can I go... I, I can decide to go down if I want, but I cannot because I cannot kill everyone. So this is a dead end for now. It's actually kind of complex how it's all set up. All right, I'm gonna go back to save before going on another adventure. Mostly save to heal, you know? I just kind of want to stay healthy in a place full of robots and things. Well, that was a... I did it. I found the core. All right, so that thing is just shooting everywhere. Oh, man, there's that time where you are not allowed to shoot after being hurt. And it never feels great. I understand why it's there. Like, I feel that's a much better, uh, harsher punishment than just losing damage. Like, it's, it's like, you can move, but you cannot damage anymore. It's like, ah, uh, ah, uh, I say. So, all right, here was an orb, which lets me continue to another world. But do I want to do that right now? I mean, that other world is where the question mark is. Uh, question mark guy. Oh, and I can also open up here. Oh, so maybe it opened up here and not the other place. It's possible. Yeah, that's right. Close, long range fight with a worm. There you go. But this will lead to an also another world that I might not want to go at. 
I don't know, actually. Okay, let's return them. Maybe that, that's like one, that's one of the things that makes hard mode hard mode is that, you know, you can't like rely on the question mark. No, no, I can still go here. I'm going to follow what the game suggests. Military storing. Like, I, I think that just makes sense. So the reason I cannot progress there is just because I got a guy to kill. That I can't. You know, he's out of the way. Welcome to a place with a robot, okay? Again, things here are pretty alright. I'll take a path and I'll go there. And get bopped on sight. Oh, this is getting filled up real fast. These turrets are serious. Like, this is the silly bunch. Alright, why? Okay, you're dead. Alright, now I can go here if I want. Do I? I, I went. I, yeah, I'm, I'm dodging into the projectiles. But it's pretty good. Alright, you know what? I'll just scoot back and heal. That's fine. It's probably fine, and we'll call it fine. Hey, look at that. Fine dining with Euro 4. That's what it looks like. Alright, I can just kind of ignore people and stuff. Well, look at that. Here's where there's an orb. Whoop, get shot. Watch, oh, there's a lot of projectile. I'm missing the blade. I feel like in, you know, in the end game of normal mode, I was starting to understand the value of a defensive use of the blade, and of course, now I don't have access to that. That's fine. Now we're going on down, destroy the world. Robots there. Okay, yeah, so putting myself in a corner here, that is not the way to go. That was a mistake. That was a tactical mistake. I will admit to it, you know, it's that was not a good idea. Do something else, perhaps. Consider it. Oh, I'm considering it. But yeah, I feel like destroying the turret is like is what you want to do, and I'm I'm trying to concentrate on that, but oh shoot! Except I say that, but clearly I had destroyed the turret, and I somehow failed to notice. Uh, yeah, because yeah, like I was still seeing all the projectiles everywhere, right? Yes, yeah, it's, it's already destroyed. Um, so, you know, that's a thing that's happening. I'm destroying a bit more than, uh, than I think I am. It's just that, you know, when you destroy a thing, that doesn't mean, like, all its stuff is going to, uh, you know, stay or unstay. I guess, yeah, it's like if in my brain, you know, oh, the projectiles are still there, so the guy is still alive. That is not true. That's not how things work. Welcome. Okay, well here I cannot do anything until I get sponge. Uh, who wants to get sponge? Sponge time. Check out it's a robot flying at me, but most of the forces are contained in these tiny rooms. Poor little guy. All right, so just sit here and shoot. Yeah, so hard isn't that hard yet. I'm sure things are gonna escalate, but like hard honestly feels pretty fine. Hey, it's that thing I never could get. And I still can't. No, I can. That opens up sometimes. Uh, can I do damage to you? Well, I can get sandwiched. That is an option. Interesting. Look, I'm probably gonna... Probably shouldn't just die. Anyways, yeah, I think I would want to have the blade first so I can pop that guy first. But fair enough! Okay, so this time I might actually get a thing. So apparently the puzzle, the the, 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 the solution to that puzzle in normal is you know the, that barrier that I thought maybe I could cut or something one day? Apparently you're just supposed to tank it with uh, the extra defense you get from fighting the two twins. Which I think is wild because I didn't think it did like a set amount of damage. I thought it... Uh, you know, it just killed you. So I didn't think that, well, I guess maybe it just does, like, uh, like, a hundred HP, assuming that's the, you know, highest amount. Okay, and then you can survive. Yeah, okay, I can see the logic now. This place is wild. It's a weird, like, weirdly open with, like, weirdly open doors. I don't know, it feels strange. The concept of a door that is open? Well, it's more like the concept of a door that is large. There is no set limit for the size of a door, for it to still be a door. Not even usable as a door. As long as you have the technology in place to make it work. 
Check it out, it's robot and worm. Well, it's, I don't know, I call the thing on top that goes on the ceiling a worm. But like, that's, it's like also called the things that are clearly worms, worms. You know, there's a bit of an overlap in my use of terminology. I don't know how I feel about that. I, I don't really care. <laughs> that's how I feel about that. The boss is down there. That is for sure, but here's a safe. Whoa! Out the floor. Do I do that or do I go on? Let's finish the zone first and then we can boss. Uh, I cannot return here. Wait. I guess that's fine. But yeah, like, if I, yeah, this is a one way shot. Okay, I gotta destroy this gun to open. Yeah, the mines too. The mines count of enemies when we're in a clear zone area. It's just how it'd be. Because, like, if I go in, like, the place that is more obviously a bonus, there might be, like, a thing I can use. It might also just lead to a computer. But, like, you know, like, I don't know how the boss is gonna be. And uh, being as ready as possible sounds like a smart thing to do. Put things in your pockets and then forget them there for several months and then be surprised when suddenly there's a odd smell in the air that follows you wherever you go. Gotta destroy the door! This door is mad at me for being me. Oh, geez, big projectile there. Yeah, yeah, okay. I got hit a few times there. I really shouldn't have let that happen. Oh man! But I mean, now it's open forever though. So you know what? It's, it's a valid victory. Man, that is a lot of projectile though. Like, from one enemy? Like, that is, uh... Impactful. That's how I'm gonna describe it. <laughs> that's an impactful enemy. And all that's left is the one dancer robot. Hey, computer! Check it out, it's computer! Oh yeah, I don't have a warp. Uh, here is weird computer! <laughs> Our ten computers... Totally! I can warp! Why did I think I couldn't warp? I don't know. Yeah, that's just a thing you can do, like, from, from Game Star. Is just, you can warp in this game. Embrace the warp. Uh, Alright, so, welcome to this place. Robot fly to me, and so I will safely go down in history, and also at the bottom level, to shoot a gun in its face. Hey, it's the military storing boss. That's not a name, that's a description. So, uh, okay. So that is the first boss. It is a repeat. Oh! Reflections turn into counter projectiles. That's fun, actually. Okay. Alright, well, there's a core. Like, I don't have to empty you out. I'll, as long as I just always face here. You do create little guys, which I feel is the strongest attack an enemy can have in this game sometimes. Alright, it's kinda okay. It's got a flower pattern. Please fly away, friend! Uh, you got passengers. No, I don't. Well, I do. Like, I got, like, a floral gut and stuff. That's passengers. Actually, I might be a robot. Like, considering how in the ending was like, Oh, old master, you used to be a servant. Uh, you're dead now. You know, like, you know, I, I am a... Oh, shoot. I am like a guy gone rogue. Anyways, I died. Pretty badly. <laughs> I, look, I, I made a gambit. I was like, can I do it? Can I dig my way before he rams into me? And the answer was no. That's just how it is. It's fine though, it's okay. Whoa! There I'm, see I'm doing the same strat again, and it's, it's not working. Oh shoot, sure. okay, that was not on purpose. That was me being clumsy. There's no other words for it. Okay. Come on. Stop. Alright, then yeah, here you do the flower pattern, and there was a bounce that I didn't see coming. Whoa, uh, okay. No. I feel like I'm getting worse with each of them. Yeah, no, I am getting worse with each of them. No. Why do I keep doing this?
Hey! And wow, I barely took any damage, too. So yeah, it's just... Just a boss that requires concentration, and I... Uh, uh. <laughs> that took some work to get out. And check it out, I got... Wow, that goes further than I remember. Huh. Would I be able to go down that one thing now? Probably. Well, let's check out what's over here. Uh, passage towards that whole block area, which is the next place we want to go. But since I'm here, um, I think I have access to that lower thing there, I think. Alright, yeah, I, I took damage, it's fine. All I want to do is check this place here, yeah. So now I can just go here immediately, and like... And this leads, this is just a path towards there also, so I have two pathways to get there. Okay, which pathway will I take? I don't know, but I have the choice. So yeah, it's not super clear because there's that question mark thing, but I think, like, I don't know. Hmm. I don't have the ability to attack underneath me yet. And that doesn't go through walls, like, you know, like, it just does not. Like, in spite of being pretty big. So, next time, new era. I, honestly, progress might be a little bit slower and hard, which, you know, I think is pretty normal.